Hello, my name is Pim Pao Son. My ID is OG2. Today I'm gonna present the project called Urban Wetland Botanical Garden. So, first of all, I want to show you how many water that Bangkok had been collected in the city. And it also tells the, the history of Bangkok that used to transport by boat and live along the water. But this is the situation in nowadays. People keep away from living outside because of the environment outside is getting dying, which also affects the nature in the city that we live in. So I believe in the sentence that say city are part of natural world because nature in the city is far more than just tree and garden is it is at the air we we breathe and the water we drink every day. So I was asking myself, can architecture turn this problem into another creative way of living in the city? So this is the thesis statement. Urban wetland botanical garden that create the relationship between people and nature in urban context by using nature to create new, new activity. So I propose the process to let people begin to create and learn from nature by combining the conservative space and natural learning not only just guide people how to see the nature but let them create something creative from nature as well this is some painting area of each conservatory that i propose as urban wetland botanical garden so to guide people more understand about wetland nature i lift the wetland conservatory up to let people get caught to the nature. This is some some diagram that I just show you how self serve garden is working into the section and plan. This is the whole functional diagram of the project. So coming up to the side, this is the condition that condition the side condition that compared to wetland condition that we could create more wetland into the site because what what we have already was the water and the plant but they don't have the con the connection between the water and the land this site was in the middle of the Magasan Lawe community Look at the context. This diagram also show you how people come to the site and this is some more exciting theory. Information, type, size and shading of tree that we have. The next is the T seed concept. Now we are going to the T seed concept. This is the section of wetland nature and type of it. So from the element of wetland and the element of urban, I want to combine it together. I want I want to combine it together because the urban and wetland could represent the, our city and also show, showing that Bangkok has begun from the water. People usually live along the Klong and along the, the river before Bangkok had been created such a big city. 
So from the element of high life building into Lim Kong housing and also into the urban wetland, this is the characteristic of, that I want to create. Here is some image of elevation that I decide to achieve the concept. Because I want to represent the people that we could live with the water. As an architectural student, this is the concept that I want to achieve. So this is the diagram that show how sideband has been designed. I create the main infant to let people who come to visit the museum and the tourists who live in the hostel and hotel as the main infant and also create the support entrance for people who come by boat and the service entrance in the, into the back of the building. So the programming in the site, people will meet with the public park first and then enter to the building. So when you arrive, the lobby, this is the first page that you're gonna see. The next page is Canopy Conservatory. The next one was the exhibition spade that was on the ground floor and you walk into the woodland conservatory into the back and after you alive the woodland conservatory you have to get up to the second floor from the stair. After you getting up to the second floor, this is the wetland conservatory space. So after you alive, after you alive the wetland conservatory, you going out, and you are gonna meet the terrains, the learning terrains, and also you can choose that you want to go to the library or the auditorium or go to the sales surf garden. This one is the underground floor band. So this is the whole section of the site and also the building. So like I said, people are gonna meet to the public park first and then come to the lobby and then they're gonna meet uh, the Canopy Conservatory exhibition and then come to the Woodland Conservatory. The right to the Woodland Conservatory was um, also show you that people also can see the science spade, the spade of laboratory of the seed archive and the gold room, people also can see it when they walk to the woodland conservatory. So this one is the section that had been cut to the spade of both wetland and exhibition. And when you are, when you get out of the wetland conservatory, you can see the learning terrain that I said. So you can choose where, where you want to go, to the auditorium, to the library, or to the self serve garden. So this is the elevation of both, uh, of both the back and 
into the front of the, the, the building. So this one is uh, the back of the, the building that I want to create the, the form that the plant also, the canopy plants also growing outside of the, of the, the glass house and also let people see some some woodland plant as well so the element of uh, limb crown housing are combined with the wetland and also the the big cube of the canopy consuetely and lobby are represented as a um, high-rise building that urban and wetland are combined together to create the characteristic of the project and also the characteristic of Bangkok. Thank you.